Are you looking for a cocktail that's refreshing on a hot day? Well, I'm Chef Anne, welcome back to the kitchen. Today I'm gonna to show you how to make an iconic mint julep, a staple of Derby Day. That's right, the Kentucky Derby is just around the corner and nothing goes better with a hot brown sandwich on Derby Day and a mint julep. Well, if you don't know about the hot brown sandwich, be sure to check out my video on how to make it with all the tips and tricks you'd expect from a professional caterer. Get ready to stir, muddle, and savor as we take your home bartending game to the next level. Get ready to sip in style, it's mint julep time. We're gonna make a classic mint julep. And here's a little trick to make crushed ice. Because a classic mint julep has to be made with crushed ice, it just does. So if you don't want to search your neighborhood to find crushed ice, I just put ice in a double zippered bag. I cover it. You can use a mallet. You're muddling. You can use it's very good to get out the aggression. You can use your ice scoop, you can use a muddler, you can use a rolling pin. And there you go. Crushed ice. We're gonna make our classic mint julep. I have a selection of bourbons here. You can use any bourbon you like. Your kitchen, your rules. You knew I was gonna say it. We're gonna add some fresh mint a rocks glass and our classic mint syrup, which I made earlier. Add a few of our mint leaves, basically about a sprig full. Mint, smells so good. It's classic and iconic, just like the Derby. Boom. I'm gonna add about a half an ounce of the mint syrup and I'm gonna muddle it. Old school style, use a wooden muddler. Don't ask me why, but it's great. And what we're doing is we're macerating the leaves and it's releasing all those wonderful aromatic oils. It smells so good. We're adding extra mint pow to this by the simple syrup that I made using fresh mint. I'm using a Kentucky bourbon and you're gonna do about two and a half ounces. So it should come to about the half of the glass. Now, hey, we've had a long day, derby day. Let's have some fun. Then I'm going to uh, give it a little stir first. And then to that, we're going to add our crushed ice, which I beat fervently with my muddler. And then one more time. And you just give it a nice stir and you want it to get nice and frothy because there's nothing else that goes in this. So that's pretty strong. So you want the ice to a little bit dilute. Classic mint juleps are served in a mint julep cup, oftentimes silver that's already been in the freezer, so it has that wonderful frostiness that you can build the glass in. Okay, last but not least, we have to have a garnish. There we go. And now it's time to taste. I think I'll taste the one that's a little stronger. Happy Kentucky Derby Day. Cheers. Mm. Wow, that's got a delicious mm, punch. The sweetness of that mint simple syrup really brings out that bourbon. And oh my gosh, I think I wanna stir it a little more. It's a little strong. <laughs> now sometimes I'll add just a splash of bubbly water on top and that makes it go a little bit longer. This is for sipping, nice and slow, Southern style. Happy Derby Day. Mm. Wow.